Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to episode three of this Terra Firma Craft Mod Trainer. Before I get into construction of a simple house, let me explain that this mod has gravity. Cobblestone and dirt just won't hang together. In later episodes, I will talk about support beams and stuff like that. But one thing I do wish to show you, leaves do not act like a barricade. If you dig a little area under the tree, the spiders and skeletons and uh, creepers can still get in there. Also, uh, in the thick, dark forests, the branches and leaves will mix together between trees. You could actually find yourself completely blind to what's in front of you. So uh, I'll probably talk more about that when we get into landscapes and uh, the terrain of this world. But let's talk about a little about, about gravity. I have in my hand, if I can see it, yep, soil. Now let me show you. It falls down. It, there's gravity. It's pulling on it. Ah, but this one's not doing it. Why? Well, it's kind of supported there, so it's not going down. But let's see this. Yeah? Yeah? So gravity does work here, folks. So let's put one here, see what, where it goes. Okay, now here's a stone, and it will become cobblestone. And it's pretty solid. It's going to stay there. It's uh, pretty good. Of course, you can't break it now unless you have uh, a pick. And if you place it in the wrong place, it's going to stay there. So, let us uh, do very quickly a house, okay? Using these principles. One last thing. Let me show you. wood will stick to things. It's kind of a support beam, a, very, a broad, big support beam, but it, that will work. And of course, you can cut that with a uh, axe. Now with this knowledge, of course, the first obvious thing is don't make any multi-floor uh, structure with uh, soil. Where did that... Did you take it? All right. But uh, let's go find a nice little clearing and do a quick little uh, job uh, with the understanding this is something you might want to do on your first night or if you had still half the day to go I'm gonna make something that's kinda big so it's probably not the best example of a first night let's do something relatively simple When I played this game, the uh, first game, I made what ended up being more of a lean-to against a cliff, and I expanded on it. So it now has walls and grindstone and a little area in the uh, mountain next to it. So it's, it looks nice. If I'd known the principles of uh, making this beforehand, I'd probably made it differently. Okay, so that's nice. Let's go stone, boom, oh, see, gotta be careful. A little too close, I think. Um, I'm going for the neat because I'm anal and you know the whole everything has to be cornered thing but if you're doing survival I doubt you're gonna be worried about corners so this is really quick and dirty now the problem whoops see that there problem <laughs> let's get in here now obviously now you have a house you want to uh, create a fire so you can make torches why do I have eggs and fried eggs I have no idea let's put it right there Q throw one two three start it start it 
No, you don't want to go in? Okay, let's try it again. One, two, three. Start it. Start it. Come on, guys. One, two, three. Paper can help. Ooh, this doesn't want to do it. Oh, I already used up the uh, fire starter. Let's try this again. Wow, I never had this much trouble with starting a fire. Wait, let me try something. Let me try something. That's not what I want to try, guys. Try it again. Do I have any stone left? Yes. Okay. All right. So I got a f obviously a non-flammable surface. There. All right. Okay. Get a few fires in there. Get a few logs in there. I mean, and get some torches. Now, what else I'm gonna do? is hmm. all right didn't want to push shift but it works either way obviously what I'm gonna do now guys is make a workbench one two three four save the rest of those bam now there are sinkholes in a uh, terraformer mod so there's probably uh, to be safe I probably want to do this but I don't want it near the fire so I'll do that and also with this I can not too sure I want anything near the fire once again so I'm going to make that there and I want one more thing before I uh, close the uh, place off let's see how that's doing okay let's put some more sticks in there get this out that's what I want right there right door it's gonna be a little colorful Beggars can't be choosers. Whoa! Yeah, yeah, see? Too many. Too many, uh. I hit it too many times, and now, now I'm blocked. Okay, well, there is. You can. Watch this carefully, guys. You screw up a stone, it takes a long, long, long time. And I'm not going to get anything from it. I hit it with the right key and I ended up with two cobblestone step one and now I'm gonna to have to pay for it in time because I just locked myself out of my own shelter if there's a party with me they'd be laughing at me while protecting me but if I was a single player doing this in uh, above a non peaceful setting and I would not be finding this very funny I'd be getting very mad at myself but the mistakes I make are mistakes you won't make. Also, I do have a wireless uh, mouse. I think sometimes that is actually might be, you know, sexy and cool, but I think there's a lack of control in that kind of situation. So, wait, I did want to do something else. Oh, yes. Duh. So, here we are. Nice, cozy, kind of simple. Now, the problem with this is that, of course, it takes a while to do this. Uh, if you're in a multiplayer server or with multiplayer uh, on your own computer, you have a few people with spears, they're watching and everything, but this is kind of small for a whole group. Uh, I mean, there's just enough room here for a bed if you collected wool and everything. And reminder, a reminder, collect stuff. Collect all the stones, collect sheep, uh, wool, you know, uh, get as much as you can. I know the first night people don't like destroying trees and all that stuff. Uh, when you're collecting trees here, there's not going to be any saplings falling down. There's not going to be sticks. And so you might be upset about that. You know, there's a green kind of community within the Minecraft community. But you're really going to have to kind of overlook that and just try to do your best the first night. It is about survival. Now, let's try this with... Let's, let's say the side of a cliff. What I'm going to do is stop recording, get some more material, and then we're going to find it like a side of a cliff uh, side and see if we could do this same principle there, okay? All right, I'll see you in a few seconds. 
Okay, folks, I just found, well, let's just show you. I've been climbing, and I found this slit in the mountain. No, oh, I don't like heights. But I found this slit in the mountain, and it's not really the best because there's not really, I would have preferred stone probably back here. But what I'm going to do, see, yeah, it's going to come down. So what I need to do is um whoa it came down behind me too so what i'm going to do folks is do that yeah that was stupid uh, uh. okay i need the hammer because i just put one way too close But this is a quick and dirty, very quick and dirty. Um, all right, and I want to put a hole there, and I want to put a rock there, and I want to start a fire as quickly as possible. Ooh, I don't have a lot of sticks. One, two, three. One, two, three. Gosh, it's getting... <laughs> I'm getting the sticks back. I'm too close. All right, let's try this again. One, two, three. Wow, I'm going to fail. <laughs> this is really... The funny thing is, guys, I never had this much trouble before. One, two, three. Oh, thank you. Once again, paper supposedly helps with this. I've never used paper. Maybe I should use it in the future. Once again, guys, learn from my mistakes. Now, once again, look at this. I suppose you could pretty much live just like this. But I wouldn't advise you because you never know what kind of monsters might show up. So what we're going to do... Be very careful with the wood. All right. And we're going to be very quick because, you know, there might be monsters out there, so on and so forth. And I don't usually like to use shift, but I'm going to do that anyway. Right click, right click, get in there, right click. One, two, three, four. Get it. All right. And You're going to be outside. And I'm going to use you to uh, and you guys, one, two, three. I wonder if I can use two different woods. And I can't. All right. Live and learn, live and learn, live and learn, live and learn, live and learn. But you guys are the same wood. And voila. Okay, guys. Oh, it's almost daytime already. I hope you've learned a little bit from this. It's, oh yeah, it looks horrible behind me, doesn't it? But the first night, you don't need to sleep. You just need to survive. When daylight comes, then you can worry about beds and all sorts of other things. Uh, excuse me uh, right now. Uh, I'm starting to get hungry and thirsty. I'm going to go down to the beach. Bye-bye.